Amen. It gives me great honor to stand before you on this afternoon to present to some and introduce to others our speaker of the hour, none other than Elder Connie Dixon. We thank God for this woman of God who always has a word for us. And I believe that we will not be disappointed on this afternoon. God is setting you up. I feel the presence of the Lord right now. Amen. Just as Gideon was looking for a sign, put your fleets out this morning. Put them on out there. Come on, God. Yes. Put it out there. God, if you're going to do this for me, oh. let me know that's you. Yes. <laughs> yes. Let it be like this, Lord, when the, when the day is all over with. Let me know, oh God, that you have sent a word that was for me that's going to make everything all right. Somebody needs to hear a word from the Lord. Y'all believe him. You know, y'all know what happened to the pastor. Y'all know what happened to this one and that one. Y'all, you know, that's their testimony. But the Lord is saying to some Gideons this morning, I'm going to send a word this afternoon. And you go going to know that I sent the word and it was just for you. Woman that loves the Lord always got an encouraging word. Thank you, Jesus. Sometimes late in the midnight hour, early in the morning, she'll call you and give you a word. We need to always be on the battlefield for the Lord and do the things that God is calling us for. Presented to some and introducing to others. This great woman of God, that's all we need to say. Other than this. Elder Connie Frederick Dixon. Come on, give God praise for this great woman of God. After the praise, please. Let's all, you will hear this great woman of God. Amen. We're rejoicing and we're glad in it. Amen. There's some of you in this house that's been on my mind a lot and I can't even explain it. But I thank God for you being on my mind. Amen. I don't know why the baby's staying on my mind. Tell me, where my baby? Where is he sleep? Amen. But I keep thinking about the prophet. I just keep thinking about that boy. Amen. I keep thinking about Mickey. I'm not sure what's going on. I thank God for Mickey. Amen. 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 for what the Lord is doing in my life because God is good. Amen. Amen. I thank God for each of you, my church family. I want to take my time this morning. I don't want to be in a hurry. And guess what? I got to go to work. I thought about when the praise was going on. Preacher Frederick, I said, I told him yesterday, I said, I might call in tomorrow. So I gave him fair warning. Amen, but I want to say what the Lord has for me to say. While we're talking, we ask that you open your Bibles, please. And while we're opening our Bibles to Matthew chapter number 17, or the prayer request, bring them quickly. I don't know what in the world is going on here. 17, Matthew 17. Y'all bring the cards real quick. Do whatever they back to the story. I don't know what's on them. I'm just. Bring some more. Amen. Did you say bring them to the altar? Yeah, I told them. Oh, they down there? I didn't see them. Okay, I didn't see them. All right. Okay, they're at the altar. All right. Jesus, Jesus. I don't know what's going on, y'all. I don't know what's on the car. All I know is the word God gave me. Amen. Preacher Justin, you gonna pray for me, man? All right. We have a prayer church today. Amen. Amen. Chapter number 17. Y'all know the story, don't you? <clears throat> Chapter number 17. Let us stand if you have it. 
You're not standing for me. You're standing right now to reverence the Lord. Amen. Can we read this together? Verses 1 through verse number 13. Amen. See, something was about to transpire. Amen. Jesus was something, Thank you, Lord. something special. I heard her pastor say it Tuesday night. She said she was looking for a miracle. Yes, yes. And I heard her pastor saying it again today. She said, Mother P, you're going to be here to witness it. Oh, Amen. Hallelujah, Jesus. Said, look at God. Look at God. If y'all remember in pastor's opening statement, she said, we want to do what we do so God will get what? The glory. All right. Can we read together? After six days. Come on, read. And bringing them up into a high mountain afar. Read. And was transfigured before them. And his face did shine as the sun. My God. And his raiment was as white as the light. And behold, there appeared unto them Moses and Elijah, talking with him. Uh -huh. And he answered Peter and said unto Jesus, Lord, Lord it is good of us to be here. All right. If thou will, let us make here your attack time. One for thee, and one for Moses, and one for Elijah. Read. While he yet spake, behold, a bright cloud. Son, son, read. And behold, a voice out of the clouds were said. This is the Son, in whom I am well pleased. I delight in him. All right. And when his disciples heard it, he fell on their face and were so afraid. My Lord, terrified. And he came and touched them and said, Arise. began to preach 